everybody it is saturday and it's rainy and yucky outside and surprisingly daddy slept in until 11 a.m this morning so because he, because he literally got in bed at about like 1 30 in the morning yeah normally daddy's still up so we didn't have tech today um so tech is going to be on the schedule for tomorrow but kellen and daddy went to the burke museum that's, that's history okay that's history. at the university of washington what all did you see at the burke and museum and hey and turn around and say what all you saw at the it's, burke museum it's kurt kurt kurtzel i saw k- culture history fossils which is more history which fossils did you see Dinosaur ones. Dinosaur fossils? Wow. What kind of dinosaurs? Every, some dinosaurs. Like which ones? What like kind? there's this dinosaur that had a giant long neck. It was like from, it called from that corner. It was like from that corner to that corner. Wow. That's a long neck. What What was it called? Like it's called an empatosaurus? I think it Or a ha- brachiosaurus. It had this big body. Uh-huh. It was like... From that window thing all the way to the fan thing. It's not too big, Mm. but it was pretty big. Like that long, about that long or something. It's crazy. It's crazy? So we're getting ready for bed, and Kellen's got Bunny. This is Bunny. We have to have Bunny everywhere with us. Sometimes. Bunny has become, she's got a very tiny waist now. See, she's got a very tiny waist and a big booty. Yeah, because I, I hug in the same place every night. Yeah, we got a Seahawks blanket and we got we're, uh, we're, we're but we're also National, Geogra- Geograph- also National Geographic book for kids. So is this one, roll up, rolling bridge. Like, there's big fuss, mm-hmm. sex. So, um, we didn't get a lot accomplished today. We did some shopping, some finished up, some shopping for the holidays. We're going out of town for the holidays, so that means that we oh. have to um, get everything done a little bit early. Um, we aren't going to get a big tree, but we did get a tree to put up in our, our space just because Kellen didn't think it would be very good to not have a tree at all. Um, and then we went to Barnes and Noble and got some extra math books. Um, Kellen really wants to do multiplication. So we got him some multiplication books, even though his math curriculum is not there yet. So we'll continue with his math curriculum. I think that we're going to be finishing his math curriculum probably this month for first grade. And then we'll probably do the math books that we got at Barnes and Noble. Wow, that's cool. In December. The Egyptian hieroglyphs. For 10,000 was a frog. Ah, cool. The only zero, zero is the only number that cannot be represented in Roman numerals. So, and then we'll probably start second grade math up in well, January. Well, crows can be trained to count for loud. But what? What? Crows can be trained to count for loud. Oh, crows can be trained to count aloud, apparently. So, anyway, um... So, I guess not a hugely uh, busy day, but still a lot getting done. And, oh, I just dropped Greek Mythology for Teens. Kellen likes this book. I just dropped it on the floor. Um, so, and there's books. There's all our school books. 23 people. And then there's, there's 50% chance that two more school books back have here. The same birthday. There's, okay, what was it? In a room of twenty of just twenty three people, there's a fifty percent chance that two people will have the same birth birth. Cool. Kellen likes facts. So that was Saturday. Talk to you guys later.